It's only the second road trip of the season so far. Uh, are you worried about this at all in terms of how you guys are going to play? I'm worried about every. I mean, that's, that's in that our job is to do nothing but worry. Um, you know, the reality is you can't think about it. I, I, um, we have talked a lot about the whole, you know, faceless opponent, uh, preparing one point at a time, one day at a time, one everything at a time. And that, that really becomes the key. So, it, uh, you know, worried about something, it, it means that, you know, it's something different than something else. The, head, the net's the same height, the whole Hoosier thing. Um, but, it, it, you know, every opponent, I mean, the reality is literally every opponent from now on can beat us. So if we're not prepared, uh, we're going to struggle. And, and we need to prepare for every opponent as if it's the only one we play. Even though you talk about the faceless opponent, it seems like you're starting off Pac-12 play with three of the worst teams in the Pac-12. You think that helps you at all to this point, to ease into Pac-12 play, or would you rather start off with tougher teams? I don't know. You know, it's, it's, it's a good and it's a fair question. Um, again, we just need to treat it as if they're faceless opponents. And, do, and, and the, the whole staff is doing a really good job, I think, of um, this is what they do, this is how we defend it, et cetera, et cetera. And, um, and we just need to, to worry about doing those things rather than worrying about whether they're good or not as good, or et cetera, et cetera. Something that has been a focus for the last few years has been serving. How do you think the serve is, is doing so far here in the season? We were good. I mean, and we've been very good so far this year. Uh, we started off great, I think, against um, Oregon State, and then that was not the case um, on Friday night against Cal. That's what hurt us. We came out. We weren't serving tough. We have to be aggressive. Uh, we've talked about that. We're working on that. And, and that's we have to we have to serve and pass, and that's our key for the remainder of the year. After Lindsay led the team in errors last year, and, uh, and she's leading them again this year, or she was second in errors last year, uh, is, is there anything you've seen out of her serve after she doled it down a little bit? Oh, well, I mean, she's changed her serve. I mean, she's not jump serving, spinning it. I mean, she's jump floating, and it's good. I mean, she's also leading us in aces, so that's okay. Lindsay said she feels like you guys aren't playing down to your opponents. Does that help reassure you that they're taking the message that they are taking everyone like a faceless opponent? Yeah, that's – that. again, until – sorry, and, um, up till Cal, uh, I felt we had done a really good job of that, that we just would walk in and we would do that. Now, um, I don't think we took Cal lightly. But it's the back-to-back, -back, which is what we have this weekend. And uh, it, there's no lie that it's difficult to, you know, play right back-to-back. -back, but too bad that's the way it is. In the regionals, in, in the first two rounds of the NCAA tournament, the regionals of the NCAA tournament, you're playing back-to-back. -back, so you better learn how to play it now because they make you go home if you're not ready in that situation. Has Amanda Benson lived up to your expectations this year? Way beyond it. I mean, she's just... She's just doing things that are really, really special. I mean, she's always been a great serve receiver. Um, struggled a little bit serving a lot last year, actually serving. Um, and her defense has been always outstanding. It's beyond that now. Um, she's, I mean, she's really good. Right on. Thank, you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks so much.